is up Division 2 agents, this is Gamer for Life back with another Division 2 video. Now this one, I've been getting a lot of questions about, a lot of you are seeing these vendor reset videos and when they go to Cassie Mendoza, you're wondering how can you get the shield splinter which is in this box, you need 8 ivory keys to open this box, and how can you get the hunter killer chest piece to where you can see that in Cassie Mendoza's inventory every week. And there's been videos on it, but I know there's a lot of new players in the game, so I just thought I'd go ahead and go over the hunters again for you guys, just to show you exactly how you unlock these, this case here, and then I'll have another video uh, sometime down the, down the road with the year two hunters. But this is going to be the year one hunters. And this is going to open this box, which will have the shield splinter. So you can see, I have zero of eight ivory keys. Now I am on my PC character, which is why I'm able to do this. So I'll go ahead and take you down here so that you can see where the masks are going to be. When you take the hunters out, you'll collect the masks. So yeah, this is where all of your hunters' masks are. So once you collect the masks, they will show up here. If we take a look at the map here, you can see this is where you're going to want to go. Now, usually I just fast travel here. You can fast travel at the theater, make your way down, whichever one. I believe if you boost to, to Warlords, which I did on this character, uh, you don't have to worry about... There's usually a little side mission here. Because I haven't done any of the Hunters or anything. And that side mission is not here for me. So that tells me, well, since we boosted to Warlords, it's not here. Now, if you did not boost your character to Warlords, there's probably a side mission here that, with a question mark that you will need to do. And it gives you the first look at the Hunters. So you definitely want to go ahead and do that. And then come back and do what I'm about to show you. So the first thing you probably want to do is put your map on normal. You know, make it as easy as possible because we're just trying to get these keys and get the collect get the collectible mass. So I just wanted to put this edit in the video to say that this is to show you guys how to spawn the hunters. And I'm saying that because I am on my PC character, which is a lower shade level character. I do not have the best gear, definitely not optimized. So there are some edits in this video with the hunter fights because sometimes it just takes me too long to take the hunters out. But again, we're not here for the hunters fight. We're just here to show you how to spawn these hunters so that you can take them out. I'm pretty sure you're on your main account. I mean, not a lot of people have multiple accounts, so more than likely you're on your main character, which is going to be perfect. You're going to have the gear. I'm sure your watch is probably maxed out, all that good stuff. So you should have no problem taking the hunters out, especially if you do, like I said, put your map on normal. That will definitely make it a lot easier. But yeah, I just wanted to put that in there. And back to the video. All right, so we're here at this building and actually let me show you the correct spot. It is right here on the up the top corner of the building. So again, if you have not done the secret mission in here, you'll have to take it out. I think you go through here first, but you have to take that out first. But after you do it, you just come back and follow exactly where I'm going, which is down and around. So you come up here and just keep going straight. Then turn left here. So sometimes there's a territory control in here as well. Uh, yeah. So what we want to do, you see where that yellow box is. This is where we're going to go. And you know, you can get the box while you're here. Alright, so we're going to get right here. Alright, so when we get here, you'll see you have these targets on these windows, on these four windows, and it's sunny, so you can barely see this one right now, but there's one, and we're going to shoot from top to bottom, so you're going to shoot this one, then this one, then this one, and then this one, and it should spawn the hunter around here. So let's go ahead and do that. So yeah, 
Yeah, let's hope he's out of that kid. System curtailed. Again, if you have the Scorpio, you can get close to him. Put him on that shot. Should take him out pretty easy. Alright, good. He's out of science critical. So take him out, then we'll go up here and collect our stuff. So you can see we have one ivory system key, reactivated. And this is the demon mask. And I will have timestamps in a pinned comment with all of the masks that we're going to be getting. That way if you just need a certain mask, you can just go right to it. So this first one was the demon mask, so we'll collect that. And yeah, that should be on our wall now. Let's go check it out. Alright, so we're back at the White House, and as you can see, we do have the demon mask on our wall now. So yeah, one down, and 11 to go. Let's go get them. Alright, so we're here at District Union Arena. Basically, you just want to fast travel over here. And then once you come over here, we're going to go over here through this building right here. So let's go ahead and do that. Now when you get in here, sometimes there is a boss in here. So you just need to clear out the boss and, you know, the other NPCs. Alright, so we took out the boss. After you take out the boss and the other NPCs, you're going to come right through here. And there's going to be two phones. One on this side and one on the other side. So we're first going to interact with this one. And then you want to uh, quickly go over there and interact with that one. Because if you don't do it fast enough, it'll reset. And you'll have to come back over here and start over again. So yeah, let's do this one. Then we'll run over here and quickly do this one. And the hunter will spawn right here in the middle of the courtyard. Uh, we'll press this one. And they erupted. it. Oh yeah, so definitely shotgun seems like the way to go. Uh, if you have a nice shotgun, especially if you have Scorpio, definitely use that. So we get an ivory key, and this is the Crimson Mask. System so we'll restored. go ahead and swoop that up, and we will be on to our next one. All right, my friends. So the next hunter we are going to do is going to be down here uh, at this contaminated zone. So let's go ahead and get over there. All right, once you spawn at the DZ West Main or DZ South Main entrance, you just come around this corner and there, sometimes there is an activity that you have to take out. Awesome. All right, so you can see we are here at the contaminated zone now there was a propaganda broadcast here so you just have to take out whatever activity is over here and then what you want to do is come up here and what we're going to want to do is shoot out these wider windows now it may have a different look during the daytime but you'll see the ones i shoot just shoot the ones that i shoot okay so we're going to shoot at the bottom of the window here here. We're gonna skip this one. This. Here. Here. Then we're gonna come down here and shoot the bottom there of are all of these. And then this one. And this is on the corner. You do want to try, I mean, a shotgun works really good against the hunters if you can get close to them. But you want to be careful because if you don't take the hunter out, System then back you online. will have to wait until the next day to take him out. So there we go. You can see he died on me. So we got the ivory key you saw in the corner there. And this is the Spectre Mask. So, yeah, collect that one, and on to the next one. Alright, my friends, we are at the next one, and this is going to be right on, we're coming to this underground entrance. So, what I did is I fast traveled over to Lincoln Memorial, and then you just want to click on this entrance. You can see it's the bottom one of these three, and then make your way over here. And this needs to be done at night, so after 2100, 
And let me show you what I'm talking about. This is the time here above your inventory deal. This is the end game time. So after 2100 is nighttime. And that's when this needs to be done. It has to be done at night. So yeah, we are at the entrance. So let's go down. <clears throat> then we're going to turn left. And then in this room, turn right, go up these stairs. If you have not grabbed the uh, Echo, you may want to do that. And there's also uh, some shade, a shade box in here somewhere. If you haven't done it, then you'll see it somewhere over here. But anyway, we want to go through this computer and use this laptop. So we press the laptop. And you can see it lit up. And you can see the X on the map. And then the moon is indicating we need to do it at night. So we're going to have to come here. That's right in front of Lincoln Memorial. It's basically where the water is. So if you ever came over here to get water for your resources. Detected. Nearby location guarded by it is right here, so this is where we need to go. So let's head over there. So we're gonna make our way down to the water. So we made our way to the water. There were some enemies I had to take out. So you can see the flashing light. As soon as we shoot this light, the hunter is going to spawn. So make sure you have your cover wherever you're gonna be and shoot the light. So we want to make sure to keep our eye on this hunter because if they do despawn, like, like I said before, they will, uh, you will not be able to do it again until the next day. So we got the ivory key and the gold mask. Alright, so we'll pick that up and on to the next one. All right, so we are at our next location, and this again needs to be done after 2100 hours. So let me show you exactly where I'm at. You want to come to this triangle here. So I'm all the way at the bottom right of the map. You're going to want to come to Liberty's Call and make your way over here. And when you come over here, you will see the big flag, and you'll be in front of this steel that has a lot of fallen soldiers' names on it. And what you're going to want to do, these lights may be on or not, but you want to shoot these two lights. And then you're going to want to salute. Maybe we need to be on the outside. Next ivory key. System reactivated. And of course, the Wrath Mask. So we'll pick that up. Yeah. And on to the next one. Alright, so this one you have to do at night again as well. After 2100 hours. So what you need to do is take Washington Monument out. You want to go ahead and take Flooded Levy out as well. Because we're going to need to fast travel, travel here. Because there, there is a few steps to this. So first, after you take this out, you want to come down here. Alright, and you want, there is a uh, collectible here if you have not been down here. But you want to go to this computer or this interact deal and interact with it and it's going to come up three locations now if you want to take a screenshot of that or whatever or just watch the video because I'm going to show you exactly where to go so we have to go to those three locations and uh, do something so let's go do that 
So the first one is going to be just under here somewhere. So we're going to fast travel here and then I will mark that. So when you get over here, we're just going to mark right under here. And this is where we're going to go. All right, so it's right here. We're coming to this grave and I put a flashlight on my pistol so we can see. Coming to this grave, you can see, and I'll show you exactly where I'm at. So, right here. If you want to take a look at those coordinates. Okay. And what we want to do is salute. So, if you look at your waypoint, the uh, the map of the top left there, when you salute, that should have like a little fuzzy, staticky thing going on, and, and that'll tell you you did it correctly. So, let's do that and take a look at that map top left and there you go so we got this one now on to the next one so this next one is gonna be right around here so just under the control point so we're gonna come back over here all right and then we're gonna and we're gonna make our way over here so this is the grave right here. I'll show you exactly where that is. System reactivated. Here you go. You see? Friendly control and point we'll nearby. Same thing at this grave. Salute. Whoops. Didn't do that. Okay. Salute, and we'll take a look at that map in the left top top left and it should there you go now we've got one more that one is going to be over around yeah it's going to be right around here so let's go to that all right Alright, so we made our way over here at this last grave. So you can see exactly where it is. Look at those coordinates 11043009. And we will salute here as well. And that is it. So now we have to go back in to the Washington Monument where we were. And I'll meet you in there. Alright, so we're coming back down here and we are going to interact with this one more time. And this time it's going to bring up a circle. So, what we're going to do is now go back up. And we are going to see that circle right outside. You can see there. And we are going to go in the middle of it and it should spawn the hunter. System curtailed. Alright, so this next one is by this Christmas tree, and behind it is going to be this room. You need to do this at night and before 7 o'clock, so, I mean, it's a little bit later. It's 1 in the morning. This is going to be four hunters. So, let me show you exactly where I'm at again. You can see I am where the water is. Here's the settlement. See a wide view. That's the settlement. Just north of the settlement is a contaminated zone, and I am to the right of that where the water is. Okay? So you can see the Christmas tree. We come to this room back here. There's going to be a lever. Lever. Yeah. So you want to pull this. 
and then we're going to go to the Christmas tree and we're going to run circle, just run around it. And while we run around the Christmas tree, they will eventually spawn. And again, it's going to be four hunters, four masks, one ivory key. Alright, so if that does happen to you and you do unfortunately die, um, make sure and come back because you will. The mask will still be here. This is the cross mask. So hostile control point nearby. I'm gonna have to come here the next day, which I believe is just the in-game day. So not like actual day. All right, my friends, I am back here, and it did just turn 2100 hours, so now we can go ahead and do this, and let's try this again. Okay, if we can... Hostile blinder firefly detected. Rogue sniper turret detected. There we go. Hostile sniper turret detected. Saved you guys the trouble of watching that. That was pretty awful. <laughs> that took. Not only did I have the hunters, but I had a lot, and I mean a lot, of enemies come over here. So you can see we have an ivory king. So let's pick that up. This uh, particular hunter did not drop us a mask. Now this is the diamond mask. So we'll pick that up. All right, here's the other mask. This is. The death mask. Cool. And I do believe that the fourth, the other mask, the fourth mask did not drop. Sometimes that does happen, and you just have to keep, basically, you just have to keep doing this again until you get it to drop, unfortunately. Alright, so I came back to take the hunters out again to get that other mask but apparently I guess I missed it because it's laying right here so yeah this is a phantom mask and that was the last mask we needed for this area all right last but definitely not least we let me show you where we're gonna be exactly right on the other side of this building now I fast traveled over here and I came down this way uh, underneath this tent when you come over here there is some explosive bullets so if you want to put those in your gun it'll help you out and I'll show you exactly where we're going alright so basically when you get here you see the green stairs just come up here we are going to come around to the swimming pool. This does need to be done at night as well after 2100 hours. So, we're going to, oh, let me show you exactly where I'm at. So, right here. Those coordinates. All right. And basically, once it's nighttime, you get in the swimming pool and you just do jumping jacks. And that should spawn the hunters. There we go. Rogue incinerator turret detected. Hostile incinerator turret detected. Rogue stinger hive detected. Hostile stinger hive detected. Rogue One hunter firefly detected. All right, and two hunters, and there's our last key we need. And this is the Midas mask. Let's go pick up the other one. And 
and we have the Revenant mask. So there you go. That is all the masks. So let's go back to the White House. All right, so we collected all of the ivory keys. So let's go ahead and open the box and you'll see, get the shield splinter. This one's actually not that bad. Uh, so now this shield splinter will be at Cassie Mendoza every week when you go to her vendor, all right? So we'll pick that up. And now let's head down here. You also got uh, an ivory uh, skin for your guns. So that's cool. And this is all the work that we just did. You can see all the masks that we got. All right, my friends. So I hope you guys enjoy this video I'm showing you how to unlock all of the hunters. And yeah, like I said, I will be coming back with another video for the Hunters uh, for Warlords of New York, the year two Hunters. That way you can unlock the Hunter Killer chess piece. So appreciate you guys watching. And as always, my YouTube family, take it easy.